introducing a new project for the channel. Now, got this quite a while back, started filming some of it, didn't care for the intro, so I'm redoing it right here. I've actually done quite a bit of work to this truck, so I started it, well, it's covered up, you can't see it yet. Just another old C10, this one's more of a Frankenstein C10 built using various years of parts and it shows. In fact, I even have a parts truck for it. So, I know this truck isn't exactly what it seems to be, especially at first. But, I'll show you what it was when I started this project. I hope you continue to follow along on this one. I think it'll be a nice kind of classic little C10 build. Please excuse the AC system. We've been experiencing a lot of high 90s and triple digit weather, not including the heat index. Now, as you can see, it does have some trouble. Once it warms up, it's pretty well fine, but that Edelbrock carburetor has got to go. Wheels and tires have got to go, and that seat has got to go. So that's a few things on the list to do. As far as the carburetor, I'll probably trade the Edelflop for a good old quarter jet. Not a quarter jet, quarter jet. I know a lot of people hate a quarter jet. I've had pretty well good luck out of just about everyone I've ever had, especially when they're rebuilt right. A lot easier to tune. And never have starting issues like I do with an Elderbrock when I run a quarter jet. And if you've seen some of my quarter jet videos, well, things almost pretty much, uh, especially in the weather like this, Pretty much go there and start the key and go. There's no issue at all. And this thing probably also needs to tune up too. But the plan is to put an original style bench seat back in it. Some older style chrome or aluminum wheels on it. Now, if I can get me a good running quarter jet, I'll probably run a phenolic spacer under it. Leave the factory aluminum intake. Right now, the way this thing sits, it will not do a burnout. It has a good 12 volt rear end but even going down the highway 45 50 mile an hour you put your foot to the floor and nothing so it needs a little bit of go you can probably see a bit of a roller back there 
That's the park truck. There's not much I could probably do with that thing. I mean, I probably could, but... I don't know, it depends. There ain't much left on it now, so... Hope you look forward to the upcoming videos of this little truck. As always, thanks for watching.